Cloudy, 75, we got Jay. And we got a 200 horsepower tune on this thing. Thanks to Evil Power Sports. She looks good, Ralph. Look at this thing. Oh, yeah. Wow. Wow. Oh. Anyways, we're going to take this thing to the dealership real quick. They're going to tune it up, and maybe we'll go for a test drive while we're there. So. Hey, what are you doing? Hey. How's it going? Good. How are you? I'm good. Apparently, Purolator just showed up and tried to deliver the tickets. But I've been here the whole time. The tickets for Boots and Arts. We need those tickets. I know. So I might have to make some phone calls real fast. But yeah. You excited for your tune? Oh, man. I can't wait. Got some nuts on this Polaris? Yeah. Go it needs, needs more power. It always needs more power. <laughs> oh, it's starting to rain. Yeah. All right. Well, let's get out of here and get after it. To uh, Jay's favorite toy store. Yeah. We got any freshies? Is that the dynamic? Uh, that's or the S or the Y? No, I don't know. It's just, it's no Polaris. Oh, that's the girl. Yeah. I got the loaner machine here. If you have no friends, and then the rest of the fleet. Guarantee if you tried the RS1. Oh, I bet I'll love it. Maybe we'll let's take it out. Let's see. There's a new one down here. I zoomed in too far. Whoops. It's a little louder. A little meter sounding. Oh, anyone need a quad? There's lots here. Since we're here, we might as well take this thing for a rip. She likes dyed diesel, right? <laughs> Don't do that to me. I did that lot like two weeks ago. Oh, did you? Oh my god. Yeah, these things definitely don't run on diesels. Anyways, uh, yeah, they got uh, quite the thing here. Lots of toys, so we're gonna take this thing for a rip. I brought the drone, GoPro, all the fun stuff. I've always been interested in this thing. Even though I make fun of it a lot. <laughs> it's like a CD, you almost need both. Alright, let's go for a spin. Definitely a weird machine. And I got two brake pedals. to have two of them and rip track this thing would be a track would be if this thing was turboed which they'll probably put on it next oh it's gonna be insane but yeah it's definitely a lot more fun i know i made fun of it a lot but it's definitely a lot more fun it's than like a harley yeah it's like a harley you drive one, you don't know. <laughs> yeah you don't know till you know oh man 
Actually, Jay, pull yours around. I'll get a nice photo of them. We'll get a nice thumbnail. Yeah, this thing is sweet. Yeah, double brake, braking gas. Got your, your water holder in the center. Oh. I'm surprised no one else has come out with one yet. Nice and close, yeah. That's sweet. Hey, that's junior, that's senior. Yeah. Daddy and baby junior. <laughs> All right, well, that's sweet. All right, we'll throw the drone up and then we'll uh, carry on and get out of here. Well, what do you think? Get the trailer. Two feet on the gas or two feet on the brake? Yeah, I'm just like I'm trying a fork truck here. <laughs> Imagine if it was manual. Ba, ba, ba. Or like paddle shift or something. He's a turbo. Yeah, yeah, for sure. It's quick, but yeah, definitely turbo. 72 miles an hour. 200 horsepower kit. We're laughing. Pull it off. How wide is this? 64. 64. Same as mine. I'm sure they'll come out with a 72 soon enough, eh? I'm not sure if they will in this one. I don't know. This one right now is dominating the race circuit. Is it? Yeah, RS1s are taking all three podium spots. Jeez. Like, so it's not even worth putting side by side in anymore. That's crazy. I well, told you, once you drive it... <laughs> Put it on the list, the never ending. The never ever list. The list of toys? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that if we win the lottery one day... This one you don't got to win the lottery for. It's actually pretty cheap. Is it? So what, 16? No, 20? Uh, I think 17 or 18. Oh, really? That's not yeah. too bad. See? You can get two for the price of the Maverick. We just buy one, put two seats in it. We could, we could fab something up. <laughs> a little trailer. Yeah, a little trailer. A little, little back seat here. Hey, okay, Brad can sit in the trailer. <laughs> in the truck? <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right, let's, uh, let's carry on. Keep it going here. Well, that was a nice little ride. I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was fun. That was nice to get on that RS1. I made fun of it a lot, but when I actually drove it, I really enjoyed it. Obviously, I just got to go up the grass strip. It would be nice to hit some trails and stuff. But uh, yeah, definitely needs a turbo, I think. You never know, though. In the trail, it might be different. So yeah, I just got back from Michigan two days ago. Just finished unpacking. Now I'm packing for Boots and Hearts, and I'm leaving tomorrow. So we got all my, we went through the rain, so drying off all the boots. We got all the, the fun essentials. Maverick, you just stay there. Don't do anything. You got some new parts on the way, but... Hope you guys enjoyed it. Go follow Elders Enterprises on Instagram and Facebook. If you need a Polaris, they're you guys. And yeah, hope to see you guys at Boots and Hearts this weekend. Obviously, by the time you see this video, it will already, Boots and Hearts will already be passed. I think it's going up Monday or Tuesday. So then, uh, yeah, summer's, summer's flying by. I can't believe it, but I am enjoying this weather. I'm loving it. I hope you guys are loving it, and I hope you're outside every day enjoying every moment of it. So... Anyways, I'm going to get out of here, get packing, get after it. Just looking at that minivan down there, flipped over. Should probably get rid of that. And yeah, so thank you guys again. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you later. Don't do anything I wouldn't do.